Hi, I'm Charles with Atlas Knife and Tool. We're going to do a brief video today on how to line your forge with Plistix 900F. That's this little bag of white powder that comes with your forge. Uh, it's really good stuff. Our, to our tools, our little mixer, some water, a little bowl, some gloves. Pretty simple. We put a little bit of water in the mixer first. You just kind of have to eyeball it. Open the bag. They are double bagged. Randy's going to be mad that I'm opening bags and we got a bucket of it right there. I like this mixer. No matter how much I stir it with a spoon, it does not get as well mixed as this. These are cheap. You find these for a buck at a garage sale. They're 10 bucks new at Walmart. There's our consistency before we mix it the second time. Looks kind of like wet plaster. Well, it's just doesn't take much. Gonna take a wet paper towel. We're going to wet down the inside of our chamber first because this stuff gets so dry. It'll just absorb the moisture right out of your Plistix 900F. Make it really hard to apply. You know, they say to use tools and spatulas. Your hands work the best. They really do. Now the inside of the forge, you can see a bit of darkening from the moisture in there. Take and move this out of the way and level with it. Pour it in. Side to side with your glove. Randy, you want to get a shot of that? Now we'll put it on its side. And we're almost done. If you get a little thick on one spot, not a big deal. This stuff sets up like a rock. Really good stuff. It's 94% alumina, which makes it extremely flux resistant as well. We're going to mix up the rest of this bag now. Make sure to put the lid on. Yeah. 
Got a little more there. Got a little bit right here. Got just a little bit left. See that chamber there, Randy? Hold on. No, that's okay. That's good. Now that two bags, this is all I haven't used. You don't need thick. The other advantage to Plastix 900F is it's an infrared reflect reflector. It will reflect the heat back into the chamber better. So your forge will actually run more efficient. The, uh, the old standby of ITC 100, which is really expensive, does the same thing. Uh, the, the 900F is really I've had a lot better luck with it, and it costs a fraction of ITC. Now, the first time you light it up, this stuff will cure almost instantly. Uh, I'm going to let this dry for a few minutes, put it in a box, send it down to a, a guy in Missouri. Thanks for watching.